Speaking of mad, I'm mad about this story. Halle Berry is speaking out after a uh, now fired radio host made racially insensitive remarks about her and other famous black women. Barry tweeted an excerpt from a podcast hosted by 97 Rocks, Rob Lederman, okay, that's his name, who compared her skin tone to a desirable piece of toast. Listen to this nonsense. Never go to a Serena Williams level, but I'm very comfortable with, like, uh, uh, I'm very comfortable at a, a Halle Berry level. Mm-hmm. Okay. also tweeted disgusting it's ridiculous this type of nonsense is still being broadcast across airwaves all black women are beautiful and worthy rob lederman get the f out of here we he ain't shit about this he ain't shit because guess what serena's whole white husband who's a billionaire bitch he did go down to the serena williams level with your poor ass you probably somewhere oh, wait a minute wait a minute so I, I, get your ass out of here was a pay an opinion I heard that he's just saying that he just doesn't, he won't go as far as a dark-skinned black woman. He's comfortably going here. with the color of a Halle Berry. What's That's wrong with that? That's his That's food because no, nobody, like, first of all, nobody asked your ass that. That's first. Second of all, that's colorism. No, that's, col- but that's colorism. That's colorism. He could have said that very you differently. You you have, have, that's colorism. He could have said that differently in, a, in this climate. And you're 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 a, you're a what, personality. You he could have said it like this: like mocha chocolate opposed to cappuccino. No, this man said, "I like a more mixed." That's what this man said. He said, "I like a more mulatto." That's what this man said to me. That that is colorism and discriminatory. That's a fool to say. I don't hmm. like them. Listen, as a black woman, I could say, "I like dark skinned men. They fine." You know what I'm saying? But. Shit, if a light skinned man come along and he fine and good to me, I ain't gonna tell him no. You know what I'm saying? That's fine on the preference. But, a preference. but as a as a white man, uh-huh. you sitting up here talk, comparing black women's skin to toast. Get yeah, your I ass mean, out of here. And I agree with you, Selena. It's to not toast. Not- I don't. You say you don't prefer. Uh, you you don't like darker skin. Say you don't like. You know you don't I, even I, like I, this. I, you, I, you don't. I, say you I, ain't gonna I, take I, your I, ass and tan me. I don't want to catch your ass tan and either. Then, huh? I don't want to catch his ass tan in no way either. If you don't like darker yeah, skin, I it all the time, like and I, I, I always say I either want to get a latte, or I say I want to be a caramel latte. But you a or black I woman, be mocha. You a black woman. You see what I'm saying? Uh, I, I, and black I, people have different shades, so that's normal for us to say because we're we have different shades and we're still black. They got one shade, sis. So to but, di- differentiate and no, no, that to toast, toast, nigga. That's what you're gonna say, toast. Listen, Lisa, yeah. I get what you're saying about having a preference, but he's a he's a like there's certain he's things you just cannot belt out on an airwave that's getting sponsorship that's catering to a, a mass audience. And I just think, I just think that if that's your preference in real life, that's fine. You can have your preference, but once you broadcast across airwaves, like there's certain things we can't say on this show, or that we shouldn't, or we know it's gonna affect our money, right? And I just think that it was insensitive to kind of like compare us to toast. Like when he's, I'll never go that. Day. Okay, you can have your preference, white boy. You just like we don't want you. You can have your preference. You write about that. It's the way he said that shit was tr- exactly. trash. I, I don't know. I, I'm not. I'm not there with it. I just think that we're so sensitive now that I think that just like how we talked about Justin Bieber video and about him using Martin Luther King. You know what I mean? He got a pass because he's more. Black, white, <laughs> he's more white, black. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I don't know. I just, I, I, I love you, Lisa that. Wright, but no mamula. Martin Luther the King Jr. and Justin Bieber, Martin Luther King was for all people. His speech encompassed all people, all love. So for Justin Bieber to embrace, that was a great thing. But this man compared black women's skin tone to toast. So what you saying? She's burnt? What, what are you saying? Why can't he have a light color toast? Why can't it be golden? Because it ain't brown? toast unless it's toasted. <laughs> Well, okay, listen, y'all. So say you like Robert. Vivica, what you got to say, Vivica? Vivica, what you got to say, Vivica? It's not what you say, it's how you say it. Yes. And and that's what mama said. You know what? He tried to do it for shock value, and it was an epic fail. Epic. Maybe. Now, if he's a Trump supporter, then do your thing, man. We expect that from you. Oh, Lord. Now you're going all. If if you're down to the insurgents, then we expect that from you because there's a lot of people out here that have balls. You know, they have these big balls that just say whatever. They don't even care no more. They just be saying whatever because they mad about the election still. So I'm uh, cool with that. You know, I'm cool with that. Yeah, 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 I'm cool with that. Yeah
know, you know what? Everybody going to get caught up now because I think everybody is going to be so sensitive and they ain't going to know what to say and how to say it. And it's going to take the fun out of everything. And everybody going to get slapped with lawsuits and defamation. And it's going to be tedious and just ain't nobody going to be able to talk about nothing. No, some things are inappropriate. Like even before yeah. Trump got out of office, there were a lot of like H&M did some, some inappropriate things. Gucci with did some inappropriate yeah. things. Listen, yeah. Yeah. things have been wrong for a long time. It is time to start calling people out or it will this slick racism shit will keep happening we have to call people out just like sean king's whole page is dedicated to uh oh look at this one over here you got somebody calling somebody something over here uh oh look at this over here. we have to because now we have platforms to be able to do that but we didn't used to have those platforms before so we have to correct people again it's just like when we talked about lgbtq and in, in you know in the in the previous conversation with waka flocka now he knows because the people been dragging him and telling him you know now he knows well he needs to be dragged and told as well so he can know that's inappropriate to compare black skin tone in to toast that is a fool like we've been cooked we ain't been cooked this is how we was born we woke up I like this be, i love to be uh baked. I, stay, I stay in the sun trying to get dark Me too. We, no, okay we, we can i just say this really quick claudia if we were to then call him crackers then that would be offensive right that's what i was gonna say can we say crackers can we say whitey no can we say, well, I like, um, I don't like the egg when it's boiled and in the shell. <laughs> I like for it to be fried, you know, where it's yellow instead of white. That's a fool. You know what? He, look, he, look, he's an asshole and we're going to take a break. 